Hello, this is how to fill up a, sam a program of study. This is a sample program of study and in no way represents what exactly is uh, done, but the format of all programs of study is exactly the same. This is for business administration because it's probably the most tricky and complicated as compared to MBA AM and MSAF. So let's say this student name is ABCXYZ. So a student needs to put their name in the title field, the student name field, the student ID number is going to be one, two, three, four, five, six format, and whatever your, your student ID number is. Now the main thing here is these credits, so fit in the comment section, fill in whatever is the semester in which this class was taken. So for example, ACC 517 was taken in spring 2020, BA 511 was taken in fall 2019, etc. And so all of these classify are classified as E R E U R. So three, 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 and twelve. And so this student has not yet taken B A six thirty five, business policy and decision making. So for themselves, they made the note that it's expected to be taken in spring twenty twenty one. Similarly, this this person has tried to do airport management, and the classes being offered in airport management are these two are required classes for airport management concentration so the student carried out this class in fall 2019 BA 645 however since BA 651 has not been offered on the campus for a while now the class has to be substituted so this student took BA 645 in spring 2021 again expected because spring 2021 was not in is in the rear view not mirror yet so expected in spring 2021 so that is something that if you're plan planning to take something in a future semester, just say expected. If it's been done, then there is no need to say expected. Just say, I'm currently doing this in spring 2021. So in spring 2021, similarly here, no need to say expected if it's, it's spring 2021, the current semester. So spring 2021. And then whatever classes have been taken, for example, uh, BA 683 has been taken among the six remaining six hours and BA 604 was never taken on campus. It was actually taken on worldwide campus and the reason is because the class was not uh, offered in the DB campus uh, for all the time the student was present on the campus. So sub by MBA 604 since this class is not being offered and in DB campus at the time of studies. And similarly, the same thing here, this student probably took a summer internship and substituted the BA 523 class with the MBA 523 class in summer of 2020. So that's how you make a program of study. And obviously, always just make sure that you put in the number of hours. So three credit hours here completed, three credit hours here completed, three and three. And so the grand total should be 21. So let's go to the bottom and 33, I apologize, sum of all the cells. There we go. Should be, what, 45, miscounting somewhere. So let's see what's going on. Oh, this cumulative total came in. So that will make it 33 at the bottom. Or there's another way to do the addition here. So take that. And is there a column for? No, there isn't. So just say some C17, is it? Yep, 17, C17, C20, actually C20, and then C27 through, so let's just fix that. C27 through 55 plus C20. C20. What is C20? Let's see. 20. C20. Okay. Not 12. So this should be equal to sum of all of these things. And that takes care of that. Copy that and not that. Copy that and paste it here. Again, copy that and paste it here. So 21 credits, done. So please make sure you fix these uh, credit hours when you turn this in. So 33 credits, done. And that's how you make a uh, program of study. Thank you very much for listening.